up, YouTube? This is Manny V. You guys are watching Inspire Your Minds. What is success? Success starts with failing. In order to succeed in life, you got to fail more than once, more than twice, more than a hundred times. So what if you didn't get that job? So what if the interview went sour? They just didn't get the best out of you. In life, things are not going to always go your way. You can't just plan out things and say this is how it's going to be done. It's not that way. Some things are just not meant to be. But in success, in a general rule, 75% is mental, okay? And 25% is physical. Now, in order to succeed, you got to have the three Ps. What are the three Ps? Simple. It's passion. It's pursuit. And it's purpose. If you don't got any of those three, you're just wasting your time. You might as well just quit right now. You know, there's people in life that has passion, but no pursuit and no purpose. You know, those people are so miserable. And you can basically see them from a mile away, you know, sitting behind the counter, putting that poker face. What's the point? You're just wasting my time. If you don't got no passion, you're just wasting your time on the desk, 9 to 5, every single day. You're not following your dreams. You're not bringing success in a, in a better format. Now, let, let's face it. In order to succeed, you got to start from scratch. Let's say you want to be a top-notch tech person. What do you do? You follow people that are in the tech industry. You know, you follow Leo, Leo Laporte. You watch Twit TV. You listen to podcasts. You go to seminars. You listen to uh, Eli, the computer guy. You listen to people that are industry. You follow them. You you try to imitate them. That's that's basically success. You know, there's so many people trying to be lawyers, but they don't got a goddamn clue of the people that are in the damn industry. They don't watch people that are, like, say, if you want to be into, a, um, let's say, a detective. You don't watch CSI. You don't watch Law and Order. You don't watch any of those crap. What, what, what good are you? I mean, you're trying to follow some field, but you're not even in, in tune with it. You're just in there for the, for the money or somebody's telling you it's, it's success in such a, such a way. See, my suggestion for you to do is very simple. If you want to be success in any type of situation, you want to go ahead and follow people that are in an industry. You want to write tutorials on the industry. So... You want to be a great tech guru, right? So what do you do is you write little tutorials on how to fix something on a computer, blue screen errors, how to uh, modify things on Google.com, on uh, Chrome, great plugins, and help people get there. All right, so these are the great plugins that's going to help you take away from spyware, from ad blocks, etc., etc. And you want to share it on Facebook or YouTube or whatever. That, that's a few things that you want to go and do. Or even get certificates on on the field, I wrote a couple of study guides on a certain certificate I got, you know, and I, I shared it with the world. So that's basically what I'm doing. I'm I'm learning from somebody, and I'm actually mentoring somebody else in that field. So that gives me a better feel of being more successful in anything in life. So what I suggest you to do is number one, follow people in the industry. Number two, keep a record. Before we leave today, I want to recommend a book I've been reading called I Beat the Odds with Michael Hare. It talks about his struggle being homeless, living in a ghetto, foster care, and much more, and how he found success with the Baltimore Raven. He definitely had the three Ps, passion, purpose, and pursue, and I'm sure you will after reading this book. And for those of you that want to learn more about me and my website, check us up on the website at www.inspireyourmind.org. And also below, subscribe. But until then, I want to wish you a happy day. Inspire soul, inspire mind, and one love.